What's up everybody, it's your boy Kiss Move, back with another video, and today I need a little bit of help. Watch Dogs or Grand Theft Auto 5? Mm, damn, damn, damn. Okay, man, um, need a little bit of help because uh, we got Watch Dogs, which is coming out um, next week, and um, you know, a lot of things leaked, you know, with the video footage and um, pictures of the game. Game looks good. <clears throat> I'm happy about that. But uh, I, to be honest, I did lose a lot of hype of the game. I lost a lot of hype of the game for probably like four or five months ago. Um, so the, being that the game is this close and the leaks do, does help bring back a little bit of the hype. But I'm just I'm a little bit on the fence because I'm not sure if I really want the game. Is this something worthy of a day one um, purchase? If, if it's going to be the next groundbreaking thing, you know, I, I, <clears throat> I'm gonna be honest, or is it one of those games that's gonna get it? Because I know everybody else is gonna get it, or because one of my friends are gonna get it. Um, one of those trend games, and um, and and that's the type of thing I don't want to fall into, and um, and knowing that you know, I, I it looks uh, attractive, but knowing on the back of my mind that there's this game called GTA Five. Um, that's been out for the um, current consoles, which is coming out for the PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4 is definitely coming out. We all know that. Um, and one thing that caught me, and the reason why it put me even more on the fence than what I was, was that in uh, one of the leaked videos of Watch Dogs, the guy was like, oh, yeah, this uh, uh, the game doesn't look no better than, like, GTA, you know, online. And I'm like, GTA? Well, that's like a 360 PlayStation 3 title. Um, and I was like, and you know they're gonna polish the game up to look good on the um, the, pl um, the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. And, and my question to you or to anybody, you know, um, to those who have made played it, I never played um, Grand Theft Auto 5. I haven't got my hands on it. I had to sell. I sold my 360 before the game even came out to um, reserve the Xbox One, and um, I missed out. Um, I didn't even ask anybody how it was because I didn't want nobody to spoil the experience for me. I had a feeling it would come out for the next gen consoles, and um, it looks like it will be that way. So, the, the, what I want to know is, should I hold out on Watch Dogs and wait for Grand Theft Auto V, or should I, or should I get Watch Dogs? Is there a distinctive difference between the two games? I know Watch Dogs, the ability to hack, and I know that adds. A whole different unique element to the game um, and I think that's what makes the two games different but outside of that what would be a better choice for me what would be a better choice for you if you had to choose if we did if, if May 27 say if both the games came out on the same day for next-gen consoles which one would you pick up and you only have money to pick up one um, so that's where I'm at um, but on the other hand speaking of watchdogs um, I'm 69 subscribers short um, from my Watch Dogs milestone, and my Watch Dogs milestone is 250 subs by May 25th. Somebody will win a copy of Watch Dogs, so I, I do want to um, remind you that I'm still doing that um, that uh, promotion. Um, but with that being said, I need a little help. Please sound off in the comments and. Um, Subscribe to the channel and, and give me some other ideas, but I'm gonna be waiting patiently I don't know what I'm gonna be doing come next Tuesday. Will I be buying? Will I be playing the game or will I be um? Watching everybody else play but um you No, know, let me know in, in the comments below and, and, and give me some input. Give me some uh, ideas. Is this game worth it or not? Kiss smooth. We out